Whether you want to ensure safe driving in poor conditions or improve your reaction time in a competitive sport, working on your reflexes is a great habit to keep up throughout your life. It's a fun one, too. You can start by just playing brain and video games for mental flexibility, then move on to working your body with ball and agility drills. You can even work with a sports specialist to create a particular training regimen. Get ready to start impressing friends, family and yourself with your cat-like reflexes. Test your speed. Grab a timer and test your speed on a variety of tasks. How long does it take you to catch the falling object? How long does it take you to make a decision given certain information? Or, more abstractly, how many balls do you drop or miss in a certain sport, like tennis or baseball? Try ball drills. If you are practicing for a sport, this is a great way to work your athletic skills and reflexes at the same time. Play a game of catch, kick around a soccer ball, or practice another sport-related drill. Try agility drills. Place a few cones at a distance apart and run between them as fast as you can. Switch up the position of the cones or run in a different way to mix things up. If you are playing a sport, ask your coach to suggest some specific agility drills that you can do. Perform by exercises. Sometimes it's not your body that's lapping in s your eyes. To get them up to speed, choose two similar objects and place one nearby and another at a distance. Rotate between the two trying to read each of them. You can also ask your eye doctor for other exercises. Practice making quick decisions. In your everyday life, try to consciously speed up your decision making. If you feel yourself delaying or taking too much time, tell yourself, faster, faster, until you make the final move. Learn to speed read. This one almost feels like a game. Time yourself as you read single pages to see how long it takes to make it through. Then, see if you can't cut down the seconds while still comprehending the material. Do this with a variety of types of reading to keep your mind flexible. Play brain games. There are a number of sites online that offer brain training. Mix it up to avoid training the same way over and over again, or your mind will adapt and you'll lose your edge. Instead, try some old-fashioned brain training methods such as playing cards or a computer game. Play video games. Get a game console and some action video games and play for 30 minutes a day. The fast-paced nature of the gaming can increase your brain's ability to process information. The gaming environment may also force you to get used to making quick decisions based on limited information. Choose something. Get a pack of gum and chew it when you know you need to be quick. Or, grab a handful of sunflower seeds. It has been suggested that chewing stimulates the muscles in your mouth and jaw, which then send additional blood and activity up to your brain. Recognize the importance of speed. As coaches always say, get your head in the game. Sit and think about how you need to be fast and accurate in your upcoming task. Mentally go through all of the preparations that you have done. Minimize distractions. If you are working on something that requires concentration and speed, try to eliminate all other things that might grab your attention. If you are driving in bad conditions and need to react quickly, then you might turn off the radio and talk less with the car's passengers. Exercise. To stay mentally and physically quick, you must take care of yourself. Exercise at least three times a week, or more if possible. Exercise increases blood flow to your entire body including your brain. Eat right. Eat healthy, balanced, and consistent meals. Eating right gives your body the fuel needed to perform at its best. Work some eggs and spinach into your diet. They're superfoods for the brain, both containing the amino acid tyrosine, which has been shown to increase reaction speeds. Get enough sleep. If you are tired, you'll respond sluggishly no matter how well you eat or exercise. Make sure to get at least 8 hours of good solid, undisturbed sleep the night. This will allow you to stay alert for longer periods. Drink caffeine. It is very tempting to down a cup of coffee whenever you need speed and focus on a task. Be careful, though, because this one can backfire. Control your caffeine consumption so it boosts your response times without making you fidgety and scatterbrained. Monitor your medications, 
some medications can slow down your response time and reflexes. Or, you may even experience dizziness or blurred vision. If you need a high reaction speed, make sure to talk to your pharmacist or your doctor about how your medications might impact your abilities.